it's here. Made with natural oregonite reef sand. Uh, what's up, coral people? My name is Remy, and today we're going to be talking about the most versatile frag plug of all time. It's the one time that I can say this product fits in the palm of my hand. That you didn't know I was a magician. Oh, uh, <laughs> that's awkward. Introducing the Easy Cut Aragonite Frag Discs from Reef Smart. Or is it Reef Smart? Is it a Mart for Reefs or is it a Smart Reef? There definitely isn't a lack of options when it comes to the Frag Disc and Frag Plug department. And I've used almost every single version over the years. So when I saw these, I got very excited. Reef Smart's innovative easy cut frag discs make it incredibly easy to propagate and grow out beautiful frags in your aquarium, whether it's in your display or in a dedicated frag system. Like I said, these are versatile. In the bag, you will get 100 aragonite frag discs. Something you may notice right off the bat is that one side is more natural looking and the other side is super smooth. The dual sided frag discs have a highly textured side that provides for a great growing surface that blends easily with natural rock work in a display tank and will look more natural as corals encrust over it. They've also got the smooth side for those that prefer a more uniform growing pattern. Another unique feature of these frag discs is that they are pre-cured. So all you have to do before using them is just give them a little rinse with RODI. If you've ever watched any fragging videos on YouTube, you may see the person who is propagating soak the frag plugs maybe overnight, a couple hours, to get all the air bubbles out before using them in their fragging session. This helps prevent bubbles from forming in the glue. But you don't have to do that with these. And I love that. There is no pre-soaking required with these frag discs. These are great for encrusting SPS like monoporas, uh, mat forming softies like zoanthids and palithoa, as well as individual specimens of LPS or mushrooms. The thin profile of this disc makes them, as the name implies, super easy to cut. They're ideal for growing out mini colonies, which can then be propagated later on. There is a time and a place for a traditional frag plug. I have lots of them. They are good for frag swaps. They're good for your frag tank, but they're kind of a pain because you got to cut off the stem. And if you're cutting off the stem with bone cutters, it could fly across the room, go right into the glass of your aquarium, break the aquarium glass, and then you got water all over the floor. And maybe that's a little bit extreme, but you know what I mean. Cutting and breaking these is super easy. Watch, I can just do it with my hands. Just like that. Now you probably aren't gonna do that. You'll probably use bone cutters. Like in this example here, we're cutting around the frag plug to make it a little bit more natural looking. But you can see how easy this is to cut with bone cutters. With a traditional frag plug, you may or may not get the shape you want. With one of these aragonite frag discs from Reef Smart, you're definitely gonna get a better, more natural looking shape when you put it into your display tank. Two use case scenarios that you might wanna use these in are number one, when you get new coral from an online vendor or you bring some home from the LFS and you want to take the coral off the plug that it came on and you wanna put it on a new plug. Perfect for these because you don't have to soak them and you can just transfer them on into your display tank. Another use case is just propagating corals and making sure that you have a smooth surface for the zoanthids to grow on or for your encrusting monopora to grow on. These are great for that. And when it comes time to propagate these, you're gonna thank yourself because it's gonna be super easy to get those one and two polyp frags. So whether you're a first time fragger or a seasoned fragger, these easy cut aragonite frag discs are a must have in your fragging arsenal. For more, click the link right here and I'll see you in the next one.